So Nelly is asking, is Joseph the son of Jacob and Rachel the same Joseph, the earthly father of Jesus? And thank you, Nelly. The, the Bible can be a little confusing because we see often many people bearing the same name. I mean, just take the name Jude and Judas. There's tons of those people in the Bible. And we don't even know if the Jude who wrote the book of Jude was the same as like one of the disciple Judes. <laughs> like, we don't know. There's so many people called Jude. Uh, Joseph is one of those popular names, obviously, because of the, the famous Joseph. A lot of people would be named after him. But we can see the lineage of the different Josephs, if we turn to Matthew chapter 1, starting at verse 2, and it begins with Abraham, because Matthew is talking to the Jews, and the Jews especially want to trace their origins and everything back to Abraham. So chapter 2 begins, Abraham begat Isaac, Isaac begat Jacob, and then Jacob begat Judah and his brothers. So who were the brothers of Jacob? This is where we have the 12 brothers of which Joseph and Benjamin were, were, were both the sons of Rachel, who was the favored wife of, of Jacob. So they should, would show up very early on. So where it says Judah and his brothers in verse 2, that's talking about then the famous Joseph who was down in Egypt and became the second in charge of all of Egypt, only second to Pharaoh. Then we go down and Judah begot Perez and Zerah by Tamar and Perez begot, 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 begot. I'm not going to read all of those because we'll be here for a while because that continues all the way from verse 2 until we get to verse 15. So 15 verses of, of this going on it says, Iliad begot Eleazar, Eleazar begot Mathan, and Mathan begot Jacob. And Jacob begot Joseph. So a little confusing, right? Because not only do we have two Josephs, but we also have a Jacob, another Jacob, who begot a Joseph. And it says, this Joseph was the husband of Mary, of whom was born Jesus, who is called Christ. So, so we see the full lineage of Jesus going all the way back from his father, Joseph, to then Abraham, ultimately the, the father of of the whole Hebrew nation. So two different Josephs. Hope that clarifies things. And thank you for the good question. Yeah. And just to let you know, too, there's a third Joseph in the Bible, too. If you ever get to that, uh, there's oh, yeah. Joseph, Joseph of Arimathea. Um, you see in Matthew chapter 27, verse 57, um, you know, there was a rich man from Arimathea named Joseph who himself had become a disciple of Jesus. And so um, just, you know, uh, basically it, it was his tomb that Jesus was buried in. And so, yeah, there is a lot of Josephs. There's at least these three Josephs that I know of in the Bible. But it's just so interesting. Yeah, the Bible has so many like Zechariah's. It has a bunch of Michael's. It has a bunch of mm. Joshua, you know, it has. A lot it has of Joshua's. More, yeah, it's got it's got a lot of people, a lot, uh, more than one Manasseh. So yeah, you you really and, have to. <laughs> and when you understand that a lot of the New Testament names are just Greekified Old Testament names, then actually mm -hmm. you realize there's a whole lot more too. Because like Jude is just the short the the Greekified Judah that we read was one of the brothers of Joseph. So yeah, yeah a lot of repeated sense. names.